everybody, welcome back to Superhero Squad Online. Today we're going to go try again for Jug Jug. Let's see if we can't uh, get Juggernaut today. Let's go get some more fractals. There we go. Quick four. All right, so we'll go ahead and jump in the shop. And, uh, well, there he is. I could use a new hat. I just burned through him so fast. I bet you do, Ghost Rider. I bet you do. All right, so we're going to go ahead and buy about, uh, about ten boxes. And, of course, it doesn't really matter because we're going to get them in the first try, right? Let's see. What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? What do we get? Bam! Ah, uh, Mini Dark Surfer. Okay, that's pretty cool. I'll take it. It could sure as hell be a lot worse, couldn't it? Uh, did we get any Dark Injustice cards? We did not. Ah, poopy. Ah, it's okay. This one here will get Juggernaut or a Dark Justice card. Or another, uh, I guess, sidekick? Is, is that what they call them in this game? Oh man, it's been so long since I've looked. Ah, four void potions. Oh, Villain's Fury, Villain's Fury, Rise of Heroes. Ah, come on. Let's go. Number three, number three. Come on, we got the Jugger box. Ooh. The shield bed. Ah. Well, we got a Dark Justice card. But to be honest, I think I have four of these already. So choose a factor and then reveal a random card from your opponent's hand. If the card is that factor, draw a card. Five for six with that potential draw effect is pretty good. I like it. I don't think it's the best one, but uh, I definitely like it. Okay, well, we're going to move on to number four. We got a Dark Justice. I can't complain about that pack too much. Those cards are hard to get, even if some of them aren't the greatest. Oh, oh. Ah, again, foiled. Okay, well, this one here we can complain about, I guess. <laughs> we were eating it. Ah. All right, number five. Number five. Lucky number five. Let's go. Another shield bed. You never have enough bed. Especially for shield agents, I guess. Oh, we got a four star. That's pretty cool. Of course, it is out of Unleashed. Four stars is pretty good. I don't think I actually have this one, to be honest. At the end of your turn, if your power is 20 or more, you win the game. That's pretty cool. And that's at the end of your turn, too. So that's really cool. I wonder if there's a deck there. Of course, obviously, you need more than just one of these. <laughs> uh, I think there might be a deck there. That could be really cool. It's an alternative way to win. I can get four of them. I'll have to check my cards. See if we, I'm pretty sure it's the first one I have. But if I can get four of them, I can see trying to make a deck around that. Just be fun. And, well, we got the... Mini Gold Ghost Riders Gold Badge. It's decent, I guess. Number six. Oh, the last one was six. Well, this is seven. Ah, uh, we got so many of these. Well, we got another Dark Justice card. It's a uh, seven for ten. Mm, not that exciting, is it? Hmm. I'll have to take a look, considering what factor it is and what factor it blocks. It might be a rare combination. Ah, oh, well. Number eight. And here we go. Bam. Nope. Growth potions. Ah. So what do we got here? Unleashed, unleashed, and Villain's Fury. Well, we got one three-star one. Not the greatest. Number nine. Pizza. I'm kind of hungry for pizza, I think of it. Boom! Ah, uh, well, they'll never go to waste. Well, if I get new characters, they'll never go to waste. I have a stockpile right now, so not really needed, but uh, it could be worse, right? Uh, what do we got? Invisible Woman's Power Quest. I'm not sure if she actually has a quest in the game, so this might be the only way to get it. Uh, whatever keeper damage you, destroy that keeper. That's kind of cool. Villain's Fury, and another Villain's Fury. All right, number 10. Let's go. Right here. Let's cheat on this one. No, don't be void potions. Ah, I'm not sure if I needed more of these or not. I know it was a card I was looking for. I think I've got my four. If not, great. I like this card. I definitely want to play it in more decks. Well, more decks that can be used in. And Giant Man's easy. And a Valen's Fury to three. Take an extra turn after this one. I like that. It's expensive. 
It's only going to hit for two, though. So that's actually not too bad. And you're taking an extra turn. Um, yeah, I can see this. Especially if you have something like a Keeper deck or a lot of like onboard damage that keeps renewing itself. That could be pretty cool. Uh, we'll do one more for good measure. Let's check it out. It's a Juggernaut. You've always got to go a little bit extra, right? Ah, we should have known. It's a sign. Ah, it's a poopy pack. All right, so what do we got here? We got a bunch of those. Uh, we've got those. Yeah, okay, we got that. And Falcon's Easy Quest. I haven't put a Falcon deck together. Oh, well. We didn't get him today. Uh, but I'm going to go ahead and buy his badge. <laughs> All right, well, we got that. Uh, well, we'll try again tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow will be the lucky day. We finally get our Jug Jug from the Jugger box. But uh, either way, thanks for watching, everyone. I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>